Any male competition that's in my way, I have to blow them out of the fucking water. Any bitch that talks shit, I need to be that much quicker and more clever and more witty to be able to fire back. What's up, fellas? It's your boy Ryan J. I'm just maxing and relaxing, chilling out. You know, um, I've been getting a lot of requests in my uh, inbox to do a morning routine video, uh, or as I like to call it, my morning success ritual. So, what we're gonna do today is I'm gonna go through that. I'm gonna take you through my uh, my morning routine. I'm gonna take you through uh, what I do in the bathroom in the morning. I'm gonna talk about some of the products that I use. We're gonna go downstairs and I'm gonna get into a special type of green shake or smoothie that I got from a mentor of mine. I'm gonna give you the recipe for that. And uh, you guys should definitely grab a pen and a paper before we get into this video. I'm gonna show you a little routine that I do. It's called like uh, affirmations and positive self-talk uh, that I do in the mirror. I, I call it a morning meeting. We're gonna get into the studio and uh, start dropping some tracks. So I wake up. Now, I don't know what time it is. It could be midnight, it could be eight in the morning, it could be any time because I do not use clocks or calendars in my house. I use earplugs, I use an eye mask, all my windows are blacked out, towel under the door. I want it completely silent and pitch black. And this vision board has pictures and images of the things that I want for my life. So when I wake up in the morning, I just stare at it, and I want to get a clear and concise image in my head. So the first thing that I do when my feet hit the floor is I want to take a piss. Some mornings I go straight to the gym, and I'll do my showering and all my morning activities over there. But this morning, I've already pre-planned we're going to be working on music. So I'm free to do all my morning activities straight from the house. I shave a little bit. Also, what I'm doing simultaneously while I'm shaving is that if you notice on my mirror, you'll see a lot of writing and little notes that are, that are taped on there. And those are basically statements, positive statements that I write to myself. And they have to be done in a certain way for your subconscious mind to absorb them and then bring those dreams into physical reality. A lot of times when I wake up, I like to listen to music have music going on in the background, but not the type of music that you would think. I listen to a lot of self-help audiobooks. To picking up girls with a wingman. Written Sometimes I like to bump the Rocky Balboa soundtrack. Copyright that gets me real pumped. I listen to a lot of video so game music. To their wishes, Legend of Zelda. What my immediate goal is, is to get myself pumped up. Now when I shower, if you notice that funny looking object on the shower head, that's actually what's called an e-water shower filter. And what that does is it filters out all of the crap that's in our public water supply. See, the fluoride in the public water system is one of the worst toxins that you can put into your body. And when you get in the shower, it's like when you close the bathroom door and then close the shower door and you're standing in a room full of steam, it's like standing in a gas chamber. All of my products are organic, all my soap is organic, my toothpaste is organic, my deodorant, even my dental floss is organic. After I get out of the shower, I want to give myself a quick look-see. If I happen to uh, be making music and then I just want to walk across the street to get coffee, there could be a beautiful girl at the Starbucks and uh, I need to be ready. The purpose of life is to survive and replicate. That means attract a mate and procreate. So you've always got to be ready to meet beautiful women. There's no excuse. I wouldn't want to be caught up in Starbucks, see a beautiful girl there, and then be afraid to approach because, oh, I wasn't wearing a clean shirt, or oh, uh, you always gotta be ready. Get high and get laid. 
just remember, YOLO, get it how you live it, homeboy, and do it how you want, come up the way around for shit, I gon' make shit happen, hustling and paper stacking, investments and money management, amateurs try to play, but they ain't pay, they do see me rolling in the Denali, Floating on 22s When Eddie shows up Y'all don't know where shit's headed 115 degrees But it be snowing in Vegas Got all them little shorties It's twerking out to my music They keep sending family Don't probably see me It's all good It's all good Little Susie up off a boat Said all them kids in Vegas Is popping the motor rollers My shit's dropping like the guillotine Big ups to all my fans in the Philippines Some parents trolling my YouTube And posting they hate mail But I don't give a fuck I smoke weed and keep it real Come on, cause tonight we gon' make it happen. Come on, cause tonight we gon' make it happen. Come on, cause tonight we gon' make it happen. Come on, cause tonight we gon' make it happen. Now, as a lot of you know, I'm a member of a lot of different secret societies. And what I'm doing right here is I'm mixing together a special recipe for a type of green shake with a very high level of nutrients. This specific recipe, I actually got from a mentor of mine. Now normally, even before I start making this shake, I actually slam about 24 ounces of coffee. Ice cold, I don't do warm coffee or hot coffee, can't stand it. No sugar, just black. Sometimes I'll use half and half. Again, organic coffee, organic milk, organic, half and half, organic coffee filters, unbleached, but I'll usually make myself a large iced black coffee. I'll slam that. If I'm in the middle of writing a new book, if I'm at the gym working out, if I'm in set and I'm talking to beautiful women, my mind needs to be ready. If I'm in the booth making music and I'm freestyle rapping, my mind needs to be quick. If you slip out of a grind on a handrail, you will fall and you will eat shit against the hard cement and I can't have that happening. I can't be eating foods with high fructose corn syrup, artificial sweeteners, monosodium glutamate or any of the other crap that they put in foods that make your mind slow and lethargic and make your body lazy. I don't need things like insulin. So the recipe for this shake, I usually start out with Almond milk as my base, organic. I'll just use pure water, organic. Chard, organic, green chard. Broccoli florets, organic. Chopped kale, organic. Chopped spinach, organic. Organic bean sprouts, organic baby bok choy. Organic collard greens, one whole organic avocado. I use a scoop or two of organic brown rice protein powder. If you have a sensitivity to brown rice or anything like that, you can always use organic. All right, man, you're doing a good job. First thing on the agenda, I want those files bounced down to WAVE and AIFF format. On your way back from the gym, you make sure you call Rachel, get a price on the headshot. Call Lacey back. We can build it. We've already built the day two. All you got to do is build another time bridge. You can finish the manuscript, add the... Uh, Whatever you need for the website, we'll go ahead and we'll work that out when we get to it. Because I want the paperback in my hand. Alright? I will have it. Okay, I want you to make sure that you get this done. Hopefully by 1600. You know, I have all my video files organized just increases my productivity and anyway that's uh that's how I start my morning the author of this book Ryan Johnsmith does not assume any liability for your personal actions the information in which I am going to be delivering to you here within the pages and or confines of this book must be taken for entertainment purposes only if you the reader. So choose to partake in any of the following advice slash activities discussed, and, or, suggested here within, then you do so, at your own risk. Upon reading this article, if you so choose to partake in any of the activities so mentioned, then you agree to waive the right to Sir Ryan Johnsmith, 
and any other applicable parties in the event of any injury, death, or any other incidental or consequential damages arising from your actions. You also agree to assume and accept all risks of serious bodily injury arising from such activities. Furthermore, I am not a doctor or a physician. Any such medical advice that is given here within, are reports of my own personal findings and experience, and, is advice that I myself have used within my own life, to which I have found to be most beneficial to my own personal success with women, with health, happiness, well-being, etc. etc. Any such advice given here within must be taken solely for entertainment purposes only, and, at your own risk. If, you, the reader, so choose to partake in any of the advice given here within, then you the participant, agrees to take full responsibility for themselves, and for their actions. Remember, before using any such advice, always remember to first consult your doctor or physician. Dedication For all you PUAs out there, keep sarging boys. Love from Las Vegas. Signed, Ryan Jonesmith.